morning, cunnies. You are listening to Essa, a.k.a. Big Macca wow, wow. on S -S Sick Radio. Hi beautiful people, it's Ariel and welcome back to my channel and today we are going to be doing an episode of Walmart Project Runway and I am going to be trying to sew from scratch. First, a little background on me and my sewing history. So growing up, I really wanted to be a fashion designer. This was when I was like eight years old and I realized that sewing is actually like freaking hard. So then I kind of gave up that dream but then the 2020 pandemic hit and I feel like my passion for fashion I came back along with a interest in sewing. I've learned to sew in home ec, but I haven't really sewn anything since then. And that was when I was like 13 in middle school. I'm 20 now. And so it's been a while since I've used a sewing machine for anything besides just like hemming pants. All right, now it's time to reveal to you guys my grand project. I came across this pattern when I was in quarantine and it is this free pattern for this beautiful jumpsuit. And I was like, I need to make this. For the longest time I have wanted this jumpsuit, I'm sure you guys have seen it if you have Pinterest or Instagram, but it's the Peachy Den jumpsuit. And it is the jumpsuit that all the cool like fashion blogger girls have. But the problem is it's like freaking over a hundred dollars and I'm poor. So I decided to take matters into my own hands. And today we are going to try and make this jumpsuit. So if you're interested in the materials that I'm using, I'm using three yards of peach skin, a spool of thread in the same color, and then a zipper. Everything will be linked down below if you're interested. Okay, so first things first, I'm using a pattern. I printed it out and just a little warning, it uses a lot of paper. My dad was like, what are you doing? <laughs> because I was literally printing out like 60 pages of paper. You're then gonna spend a very long time putting each piece of paper on the floor and then taping it together. This is just like mine numbingly boring, literally taking scotch tape and just taping pieces of paper together, but it needs to be done. So the next step is to measure yourself. This is so important because I was originally not going to measure myself and then I was like, oh no, I need to. Normally I wear a US size four and I was just gonna do like a size four with the pattern. And then I looked at the measurements and I'm like, this is like really small for a four. And then I measured myself and I realized that for the jumpsuit, I am a size eight. So if I cut a four, it literally would have been tiny and I probably wouldn't have able to get it on my body like at all. And then on your pattern, you need to like mark your size. I use a highlighter and I just like trace a line all around because if I didn't, I feel like I would just be cutting the wrong pattern size like the whole time. Next is my least favorite part if I'm going to be honest and it's just cutting out the pattern. You have to be really exact and I like am really bad with scissors. I don't know why it's just so hard for me to cut a straight line or like stay in a line. So this took me a while, but these are all my pattern pieces cut out. The next step is to cut out your fabric. So taking my paper little pattern pieces and pinning it to the peach skin and then cutting it out with some fabric scissors. Cutting out this fabric was when I realized, hey, this is gonna take forever. So then I started to watch Grey's Anatomy while I cut out my fabric and I recommend you do it too because it helps sewing become easier, I guess. After I cut out every single piece of fabric, which took me forever, it was now time for the sewing part. It's sewing day two, I just woke up and now I'm sewing, not even getting coffee. That's dedication. I keep on making the same mistake and now the same thing again. It's fine. This is a clip of me using all my concentration to sew this teeny pocket. Enjoy. You know, when I watch Project Runway, I don't think that sewing is like this. It's a lot more glamorous on TV. I did do a significant portion. I did the front and the pockets. I'll show you. All right, this is what I've done so far. Got these beautiful pockets this lined front piece and now we're working on the pants. So today's day three of sewing from scratch and you know, I don't know how this is gonna turn out. I think I seam ripped the collar like three times each side and it still looks wonky, but I'm just gonna like accept it and move on because I just I can't do it anymore. This is me attempting to seam press, but I also got scared and was like, I'm gonna burn my fingers. I also started the bottom half of the jumpsuit today. So this is me sewing the pant legs and everything all together. Honestly, pretty easy. Just kind of like a straight line down the side. Doing the sleeves, putting them on. Never done sleeves before. So this could either be really good or it could be a train wreck. Hopefully it looks good. We'll see. Okay, so today is day four, I think, of sewing this jumpsuit. So today was all about adjustment. I'm a little shorty, so I had to hem the pant legs for my jumpsuit. Otherwise, it wouldn't fit me. Also, love 
love how like the back of my hair is just a rat's nest and I just look like worse and worse each day of this process. Today is the last day of sewing. Okay, side note, but I just love how like good I look on the last day versus the days before. That's how you know that the sewing stress was real. Finally, it took me a little bit of time to get a zipper just because I was too lazy to leave my house and go to Walmart. I got a zipper and today we are going to be finishing the jumpsuit. You guys, this was my first ever zipper I have sewn and it was my own personal hell and I think I cried. I'm not gonna lie. So yeah. And before I do the grand reveal, I have to give you my mom's reaction. I sewed this. In the, from the 60s or something. That was my mom's reaction, a little underwhelming if you ask me, but here is the grand reveal. Guys, I am obsessed with this jumpsuit. I'm so in love with how it turned out. I think it looks amazing. It fits me like a glove and now I feel like an actual sewing queen because I made this from scratch with my bare hands and blood and sweat and tears. I also loved it so much I had a little photo shoot because I'm extra and these are how the photos turned out. So yeah, that was my experience sewing from scratch. This is me in my audition for Project Runway. Um, if you guys would like to have me on your next season, I would love that, uh, yeah. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below. I'm gonna do more sewing videos soon because now I am a seamstress. And with that said, I'll see you guys next time with a new vid. Bye.